Did you know the first Catholic priest came to Canterbury in 1840? Yes, two priests came to Akaroa with Bishop Pompalia and set up a mission there. What's a mission? It was like a parish. There was a church and the priest would say mass for the locals. Bishop Pompalia would visit every few months and welcome into the Catholic Church locals and annual arrivals. I've heard of Bishop Pompalia. Wasn't he the first bishop in New Zealand? And he brought some French priests with him. Yes, they were from the Marist order in France. Bishop Pompalia is the father of Catholicism in New Zealand. As more priests came to New Zealand, the country was divided up into dioceses with bishops in charge. It was Bishop Grimes' job to look after the Catholics in Canterbury and the West Coast. That must have been tough moving to the other side of the world. I guess, but he wanted to do God's work and he made new friends in New Zealand and the priests were like his brothers. When he first got here, didn't he want to build a cathedral? What actually is a cathedral? A cathedral is named after the bishop's chair, a cathedra, which is kept in the building. So that makes the building a cathedral. It's the mother church of the diocese. A cathedral is a place where people from all over can come together in a big church for mass and special events. But we don't have a cathedral, do we? No, our cathedral is badly damaged in the earthquakes, so now a new, safer one is being built in the city. I wonder what it all looked like. So even though we belong to our parish and go to Mass in the parish church, we also belong to the diocese. Yes, we are all in this together. From the east and west coast of Canterbury, north and south in Christchurch City, we all belong to the Christchurch diocese. Like a family.